Här är jag igen. Jag ska visa ett lite trulleri grejer som jag har lärt mig. Jag har drivit på med detta i stund. Eh detta är ett magiskt törkle, inte nog är fixfaxeri. Ska jag ta ett äpple. Så ska jag rätt och slett få detta äpple till att försvinna, så som de ordentliga stora gutta gör. Följ med nu. Hokus pokus 1 2 3. Bra. Mm. Apelsin är en helt annat, det är ett helt annat djur än äpple, mycket mer lumsk, mycket vanskligare att hålla kontroll på, men jag ska försöka få den att försvinna och okay. grej. Detta går som en dröm. Hokus pokus 1 2 3. Så när det i trulleri branschen det är ju många artiga tricks som jag har lärt mig. Det har varit väldigt många damer som har skrivit in till detta program och skrivit kära kära Arne det är ett väldigt fint program du har och det är massa fina trullekunstnare och mycket fint som sker men det är ju så mycket pent att se på för oss damerna. Och de skriver att du är ju käck och grej du Arne men du är ju inte så väldigt vacker och det har jag på något vis sen jag var ganska liten. Så därför så har jag tänkt att ta konsekvensen av det lite grann. I dag så har jag fått med mig en ordentlig checkar som har kommit hela vägen in från Portugal som både kan trulla och se bra ut och det kan ju vara någon för likan damerna så att det kan samla likan runt skärmen nu. Men för det så har jag tänkt att vi ska ta då en liten sån tur som som är på det bak igen i tid och vi ska se en svartvit film med en gammal gammal trillkunstnär. Han var ju gammal då men det är en gammal film nu. Han heter Frederick Eugene Powell och han visar lite såna rare ting för likan nu. Ska jag över lite. till om att de kunde sakerna sina för i gamla dagar också. Och gamla Fredrik Eugene Powell, han visar här ett trix som är helt supert. Visst du ska ha bursdag eller konfirmation eller ett land och tränger lite extra blommor och dekorerar dem. Det är att kika här på Globus men nu för mig så hem Portugal. Eh? Portugal jeg ligger över sig. Good well. Good night. Oh great. Luis Tomatos, welcome to my castle. Perfect Norwegian. Oh, to my casa. Yeah, <laughs> mi casa great. e tu casa. Thank you very much. It's a pleasure to be here. I always say good well. It's the only thing I can say in in your language. You will come very far in Norway by just saying good well. Oh yeah? Okay. Yeah. People let, will let me know. Let People me know will that. say, come in, have a drink, a so I saw there. Oh, so I can say Gukvel ten times. Yes, maybe so ten people, people will invite me. <laughs> ten people and maybe more. Maybe okay, more. okay, let's go for it. I will. I bring all the way from Portugal a deck of cards just to to show you something. Uh, well, I'm going to use a, a four aces. Um, they look very much like Norwegian cards. Oh, probably, and yeah. also the aces, I'm sure. Um, where are the aces? Oh yeah, this is this is um, a special deck of cards where the, the aces they think they are uh, rock stars or movie <laughs> celebrities or something like that. Okay. So they always want to do his appearance on a very weird way. So uh, they want to show up on a very maybe artistic like that or oh. something. Oh yeah. This is the first uh, ace, of, yeah. ace of um, ace of hearts is very important. Ace of hearts um, and. Uh, for instance, I can I can try to to find uh, the other aces, but uh, always in a, in different ways because they don't want to be the same appear the They're same way. Yeah, different cars, yeah. different ways of coming. Okay. So, for instance, we can uh, just cut the deck here and try to find the second ace like that. Yes, here we have <laughs> the second ace, and for the third, for the third, maybe we do it now completely different. Maybe uh, you always travel on an invisible way. Is here it is. Uh, so we just take it and we show it. It's the Ace of Diamonds. Oh uh, yeah, it's, it's not yeah. so visible, so you can spin it and catch it, and there we are. We have <laughs> the Ace of Diamonds. <laughs> well, for the final Ace that must be uh, somewhere in, in the deck, uh, we must do on a completely different way, because everybody's waiting to Ace to appear, so probably we just do this and catch the fourth and final Ace of Spades. <laughs> There That's we are. Brilliant. Well, we are not going to use only uh, these um, four aces. We are also going to use uh, four coins and the magic music that I brought all the way from Portugal. Oh, you brought for music tonight. I yes. don't have That's music, it. you know, in my castle, so I like that. Okay. This 
must be then the famous Portugal coins. Fivas, up på de forskjellige myntene. Luring, han er rast. Så nå er det en under hver. Ja. Det var kjekt å få ut. Nei! Det var det jeg har sett. Nå var det to under han er inne der. Ja, jeg følger med en. Hva er det her? Heisan, heisan! Det skulle være nesten vår kassera, du vet. Det er gamle banken hjemme. Det skulle være nesten vår kassera, vet du. Nei! Alle fire samler på en plass. Oh, I think so. <laughs> yes, you understand the reason. Well, no, I don't understand. No? I hope you said something nice. I said something nice. But even if you don't say, if you don't you will just never say know. it, I will never know. <laughs> That's why I will repeat it. Then okay. I have the great chance to hear something okay, nice. Okay, you're going to, yeah. I will repeat it um, not only for you, but for you in special. So pay attention right now. Det er gratis for en gang til. All the coins will appear underneath this ace of diamonds. Okay. There's one coin. I sit very near me, I just don't know anything. I don't know anything. Det er svarte grønne. One, two, three. One, there's still there, yes. And here we have... No! Like four coins. And they're back! This is... For cards. This is magic. Louis, thank you. This is great. We have to tell the, the Norwegian viewers that uh, in Portugal you have uh, your own TV show. Oh yes, I, yeah. have, I have a couple of series during the last uh, three, four years, exactly, with magic and with, with magic, guests. Yeah. And guests and... We try to dignify magic and showing the best thing that goes around the world. That's it, what you are doing here, it's a great job. I'm trying to do the, like you, you are doing, but you have done like 92 shows or something. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> You're a big man in, uh, in Portugal. So, no, I'm not. I'm at home. My parents like me a lot, and they think I'm great, but only them. <laughs> okay. Ja, vi skal komme tilbake til Louis etter hvert. Han bor hjemme med mor og far sin, og det er kanskje tryggest. Vi skal se på en, en annen kar som sikkert ikke bor hjemme med mor og far sin. Han heter Wayne Dobson, og han har noe som heter The Million Dollar Mystery. Og det er ikke for at det er så mye penger involvert nødvendigvis, men det er rett og slett for at det er minst en million til deg som klarer å finne ut hva som egentlig skjer her. Ja, spill det igjen. Hei, Gauss. You want me to sign there? All right. Somebody once said to me that my signature would be worth a lot of money. Well, today, and today only, it's worth one million pounds. Take these twice a day until it drops off. <laughs> I'm only kidding. Can I have the key? The money's mine. This, ladies and gentlemen, is one million pounds. Yep. The genuine article. You know, I needed a couple of volunteers to help me with this illusion. Couldn't find anybody anywhere. Until I said, there's a million pounds in there. They were there. Girls, there's some good news and some bad news with this illusion. The bad news is, I'm going to make this million pounds disappear. But the good news is, <laughs> you're going with it. <laughs> now, I know what you're saying. Is there a million pounds really here? Well, the answer is no, not quite. I kept a few thousand back. <laughs> Isn't that just disgusting? I know what you're also saying. You're also saying anybody given long enough could make a million pounds disappear. But I'm going to make this million pounds and the girls vanish like that. Just put the cover on there. Now when I say it's going to vanish like that, I mean like that. It's happened. The million pounds has completely gone. So, the million pounds vanished like that. That was the easy part. The hard part is getting it back again. <laughs> 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 Not what 
let me think. <laughs> Great trick, girls. <laughs> Where's the money? <laughs> nice jewelry. Looks new. <laughs> Looks like a million pounds worth to me. <laughs> I wonder what is this really? Well, I brought uh, it from I brought it from Portugal, full of fishes, uh, because Max asked me. Uh, oh yeah, he Max. He likes very yeah. much. And so where have all the fishes gone? Well, I think we both know where they are. They are in Max's little stomachy stomachy, yeah. I huh? think so. So this is a Portuguese yeah it's aquarium, a, por a Portuguese aquarium, and uh, with Swedish water mixed and with Norwegian water, and uh, from Scandinavian from countries. Scandinavian, yeah. And what I'm going to do right now is something like uh, underwater magic. Hey! This is... I've never seen underwater magic before. This is amazing. So, yeah, yeah. I'm going to show you what I'm going to Rören på vad som är nere i akvariet. Det är ju vanskligt nog det där utan vatten då. För sådana som mig i alla fall. Nej, det är inte nere i vattnet. Och det är real water. Ja, det är real water. Jag gör bara något väldigt konstigt med en handkerchief. Jag gör något väldigt konstigt också med en handkerchief. Okay. An unusual way to cut a rope, what seems to be not a very original trick. Every magician in the, wo in the world have ever sometimes cut a rope. Yes. But not with a knife. Ooh. Oh. Quick or grey? I was amazed by this water, but because I think it's, uh, also I can say in Norsk that it is a fantastic world premiere. This is what I think about such tricks under water, because it is almost never seen any time before. I don't think it's very usual with uh, with water. Well, no, I've not seen it before. It's usual to drink water, to play yeah. with water. Have it in your hair. <laughs> you can do magic everywhere, and this prove it. Very good. You see the little guy uh -oh. standing on my table blinking? I heard blinking? it's something connected with the... Uh... It's connected with a big fishy eater. Max. Oh yes. <laughs> we see, have the um, when, when he wants me to come down, he sends up a signal. And now okay. he's out of fish. Time let's, to go. Let's hope he doesn't eat me. I will wait me. for you here. Uh, this, is, this is no place for you, down there. <laughs> Thank Not you for very my much. <laughs> see you later. Good luck. Woohoo! Max! I've never been in a long time. Mange, mange, mange hundre år siden så levde det en skummel skikkelse her nede i kjelleren på slottet. Jammen tror jeg ikke at han lever her enda, faktisk det gode, men skumle mennesket Max. Max! Where are you? Yes, yes, I'm here. Here I am. There you are. So you... What's behind there, really? I've been wondering, you know. I've been down here a while now, and sometimes, and... What's behind that door? Another door. And behind the other door. Well, you can only imagine. Anyway, it's interesting that you bring up the topic of travel because that really is the, the subject of our experiment today. I okay. have some uh, pictures, and each picture is uh, a symbol for a different country. So, for example, the first one shows a kangaroo, so that must be... That must be down under in Australia. And how do you say that in Norwegian? Uh, we say uh, Australia. So it's, it's quite similar. Yeah, it's and the next one is a windmill, so it would uh, be... Windmuller, that's uh, Holland. Yes, uh, or we say the, actually in English, Netherlands. the Netherlands. Yes, yeah, the same, Netherlands, okay. Yeah. Yes, and uh, this one may be a bit more, more yin difficult. Yang. Yes, the yin yang symbol, so it would be for what country? I think maybe Korea. Well, Korea uses it, but it actually goes back to... to Japan. China, 
You were right. Uh, Burma, you were, Thailand. You were, you were right. You were, you were right, and you passed it. It's actually Chinese. Um, but, how do you say China, uh, China in, in, in in Norwegian? China. China. Okay. Yeah. And uh, uh, for this one, I think it's a bit easier. That's the, the our neighbors in Denmark. Yeah. Denmark, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, that one is must be some kind of uh, Mexico. Very good. That is actually uh, an Aztec uh, calendar. Yes. I've been traveling. And this one, I think, is quite easy. That's the uh, Liberty of Statue of Liberty America, in America, America right? And USA. finally, this one would be. Ruski. We say Ruslan. Ah, okay. So I will ask you to take the pictures and uh, mix them. Of course. Give them a good mix. the different countries. I've been traveling, you know, so I yeah. kind of know these symbols. Mm -hmm. Geography. I was good at geography. Okay, when you are satisfied, you stop mixing. Uh, okay, this we should do it. Okay, and you have mixed to which, which uh, place? Uh, Denmark. Denmark. Okay. okay. Now you have to agree it was a fair situation. Fair situation. So it would seem to be impossible that I would know that you would pick Denmark. Absolutely. But, in fact, I knew. And to prove it, I made a prediction. Okay. Yes. The prediction is right here on the back of the picture. <laughs> it's the letter D. For to prove that I knew you would choose Denmark. You're amazing. Uh, <laughs> how did you know I was a friend of the Danes? Well, it was very obvious to me. It's... Uh, I'm, I words don't come easy to me. Yes, because I know what you're really thinking. You're saying to yourself, I bet there are other letters on the other cards. You're thinking perhaps, well, for example, for the Netherlands, there's an N. Yes. Or for uh, Russia, it's an R. And to correct, <laughs> yeah. an M for Mexico. Yeah, yeah of course. Yeah, so maybe yeah. not so impressive. No, not no. really. Except I show you, if we put all the correct uh, letters down, <laughs> then the result will be okay. <laughs> Denmark. Yeah. yeah. So now that we understand one another, I go back behind the We door. understand one another completely. <laughs> I Stocka, also to the Denmark. That was your own egen på en måte feil. Jeg holdt på å si eller feil, ikke feil, men det var jo et utrolig triks dette fra det gode, skumle mennesket Max. Den er virkelig en havfru av oss. Hva skal jeg si? Altså, det blir liksom litt tomt oppi hovedet mitt. Så Jeg så på en uh, kar, en uh, yngre kar som heter Franklin, og så om ikke han har noen gode, trillige kunstnere for oss som vi kan kikke på, men så jeg står her og summer meg litt, for dette ble kanskje litt mye, synes jeg. Så det skulle jeg ha fri over her. In the dorm. I was in the dungeon. Good old Max, he uh, took me for a ride again. Oh yeah? I also have a ride. You I, have a ride? Yeah, I have a ride inside the castle. I went oh, to yeah. the kitchen. And, uh, My and favorite place. Yeah, me too. Well. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, and I found this uh, very nice prop uh, that um, I know it's in Norwegian is uh, Mix Mate. Mix Mate? Mix Mate. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Look at me with yeah. it. I use it when I make bacalao. Bacalao. Oh, bacalao is... Uh, Portuguese people know how to cook very well. Yeah, bacalao. Uh, and I found it, um, and in Portugal we call this uh, Varinha Magica. Varinha Magica? Yes, yes. Close enough. Close. Varinha Magica. So, uh, as close as my mix matter. <laughs> mix matter. <laughs> sounds Chinese. Uh, no, Japanese. no. And uh, the, uh, sounds great, this. Yes. You see? It's, it's, it's I, know, I know the mix matter. Yeah, it's you know how the they work. Well, yeah. we are going to use it, and this is what the name? Mi mi cop? Mi mix matter. Cop. Cop. Yeah. Okay. Cop, yeah. So, we leave it uh, uh, right there, and... Uh, 
for the moment, I will ask you to choose one card, any card. Of course. You see the card, you know the I card. I see the cards, I want to pick a card. I Not that one. No? No, you can. A any one you want. I think, think this one. Okay. Oh. So, um, show it to the audience. It's hi, important. hi. Skrive and I go from the show, man. Take it off. Victi, victi. Okay, I can see it. You can see it. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's a fair it's show. It's the Ace so of, ace of uh, Clubs. Clubs. So, but there are thousands and millions of aces of clubs around the world. the world. Oh yeah. Yeah, living and working and from the card factories all yeah. over. Yeah. So I will ask you to sign it and and to mm. make that ace to become unique in the world, so that uh, no one else <laughs> I make it into you. Oh, and you are so nice. I'm a good drawer. And I put my yeah, name here. I would not no say that. No color for. That that unique card. Okay. Luis de Matos. Oh, well, thank goodness have your name underneath, uh, yeah. so people That's will... That's the signature. Oh, yeah? Okay. <laughs> so let's, uh, for the moment, just uh, shuffle mm -hmm. like this, and uh, also we can uh, cut, and if you are not happy, you can cut uh, uh, 2,000 times and be no, here all night. Fine. It's okay? It's in there. Okay. So this is not... Uh, necessary anymore and you should agree with me that uh, somewhere is your card yeah. among the 52 cards of the deck is mm -hmm. yours uh, signed uh, I, I can I cannot see it but it's for sure somewhere yeah, yeah. Uh, it's your card signed my card. unique in the world everything. everything I will find it with the mixer I promise I will find it with, with the my mixer. mix master mix mix master. mix master okay not like this but also using uh, new. the, the <laughs> Mix Master Coupe. Yeah? Coupe. Empty? Empty. Ta da! Empty! Yeah. I will put the deck in here and I will use the Mix Master. <laughs> but I have nothing here, nothing here. Go for the kitchen. Go for your the ice of, uh, ice of, of clubs. clubs. Okay, let's go. Okay. <laughs> We are arriving to a very, very... Yeah, like all the cups, no? You're yeah. destroying all the cards. Not always. Not, not, not all the cards. Uh, let's see what is the result. Look, there's nothing here. Nothing here. A lot of destroyed let's cards, see. if you ask me. Look, that's uh, a bunch of destroyed cards. Uh, Let's let's look. Nothing on my hands. Show uh, your hands. Show your hands. hands. Happy. The table That's was up. clean. Mm -hmm. Let's find. Let's try to find if there is any card. Any card. They are no, totally destroyed. Very unlucky. This look, 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 look. I don't want to touch anything. Just take a, take apart that card that is completely. <laughs> and it's one card. And let's see exactly which card is this one. That it's yes. the picture of Louis de Matos! <laughs> 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 that was really true. Okay. It's really kind of, really kind of can't do with good, good, good chicken redskapper. Okay, uh, thank you for coming well, to Norway. It's a big pleasure to be, be, be here. Me, be here. Uh, be in my kitchen, you can come anytime. <laughs> my mother will be very angry about this, but we'll No, see. it's okay. I will clean it and it will be good. Let's go back here next week, but you don't have any other folks on the visit. Du er der hjemme og ser på. Jeg er Magi Jens James Last, så snakkes med. Men nå er det rulletekst. Lissi Enders. Lissi Enders. Lissi Enders.